Today I'm going to be reviewing this Honeydew Sleep Pillow that was recently sent to me by the brand. So I'm going to open this up, show you exactly what you're going to get inside, also how comfortable it is, all of those sorts of things. Now this is going to be the pillow that's going to be inside of the box. It comes with that and then also comes with a pillowcase for this pillow. Now one thing to note about any pillows that you get from Honeydew is that they are going to be kind of shrink wrapped in there. It allows them to ship in a much smaller package, that sort of a thing. So you will need to open this up and then if you want it to be usable immediately, you're going to want to throw it in the dryer to fluff it up. It will be flattened out because of the shrink wrapping. So that is something to keep in mind. Let me go ahead and get it out of the packaging. This is what it's going to look like when you first take it out of that shrink wrap. It will expand over time. What I'm going to do is I'm going to actually going to take this and throw it into the uh, dryer to be able to kind of fluff it up, show you what that's going to look like. But even as is, you can see it does have a lot of compression, a lot of usability, flexibility in there. This is going to be their side sleeper one. So that's why it's going to have this curvature in it. So if you're a side sleeper, it allows you to have a spot for your hands, your head can get further up on the pillow, that sort of thing. And then it's also going to come with the specific pillowcases for their, their side sleeper pillows as well. So let me go and throw this in the dryer. So I popped this in the dryer for 15, 20 minutes and you can see how much it did fluff up. Definitely a really good amount and obviously comes right back. Now they do recommend that you put in the dryer for 60, 60 minutes. So it's totally up to you exactly how long you want to put it in. You want to zip that, you can kind of see what this microfiber is going to look like. So it's essentially when you put it in the dryer, it causes all these little particles to fluff up nicely. So that's going to go there. Let me zip that back up. You can adjust that. Like if it's a little bit too thick for you, you can pull some of that out. Most people, this is going to be about, about right though, at least in my opinion. And so you won't need to probably mess with the fluff or the zipper or anything like that in regards to taking out some or even putting some in. Actual measurements on this side sleeper pillow, it's going to be about 26 and a half inches long. On the sides, it's going to be right at 16 inches on both of those. And then a the sensor, it's obviously going to be narrower, so it's going to be right at 11 inches. Height on this is going to vary when it's brand new. When you first pull it out of the dryer, it's going to be a little bit thicker, so we're right at 7 inches or so. If I would have done the full 60 minutes in the dryer, it probably would be, I'm, get, I'm guessing it would gain at least another inch. Because essentially the, what it does, the tumbling causes those memory foam, shredded memory foam to kind of puff up, essentially. So let me grab one of those pillowcases, show you how those are going to go on. So this pillowcase is just going to have a zipper right across the top. This does feel like a silk type pillowcase. It's only going to come with one pillowcase, not two, like I was thinking it would. So let me go ahead and put this inside of here, just to kind of show you how that's going to look and work. Just gonna kind of slide it right down into the pillowcase there on both sides. Um, and I'll zip it back up here at the top. So just kind of have to shove it down in there. And then this is just gonna then slide right inside of there. So this is what it will look like. It is does come with a white pillowcase. You could put a traditional pillowcase on top of it, but again, with the curvature of this pillow, it probably wouldn't work the best in the world. Also, it does have some le leftover space on the side. And again, if I would have left it in the full 60 minutes to fluff up, I'm sure it would have gone all of the way up. So if you were a side sleeper, this is going to be a great option for you versus a traditional pillow.